Good evening, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to this report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Hillary Clinton endorses Joe Biden for president in virtual town hall. She is a special guest at the town hall focused on impacts of coronavirus on women. Former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton is expected to endorse former Vice President Joe Biden when she appears as the special guest at his virtual town hall Tuesday afternoon. Focused on its impacts of COVID-19 on women, according to sources familiar with the plan. The 2016 Democrat nominee announced her appearance at the event with a tweet offering a hint that she would be the guest. This is what she wrote on Twitter. A little hint about who the surprise guest will be for Joe Biden's 3 p.m. Eastern Town Hall today. For his Part, the former vice president retweeted Clinton, adding his own words, I'm with her, a nod to former Democrat nominee's slogan for her 2016 presidential campaign. Clinton's endorsement drew nearly immediate reaction from the campaign of her former rival for the presidency. Donald Trump. Clinton's endorsement of Biden will have a role reversal for the two Obama administration officials who were once rivals in the 2008 Democrat primary and expected to face off in the 2016 presidential race before Biden announced he would not seek nomination following the death of his son in 2015. Biden campaign for Clinton throughout the 2016 presidential race, but offered criticism of Clinton's campaign following her loss for not speaking more directly to middle class concerns throughout the race. The former Secretary of State's announcement will come aimed a string of high-profile endorsements in weeks, recent weeks for Biden. As the primary winds down, the party begins to conceal around its presumptive nominee and prepare for the general election. Former President Barack Obama, Senator Bernie Sanders, and Elizabeth Warren have all announced endorsements of Biden earlier this month, seeking to quickly unite the party after an, at times, messy and disjointed primary field that at one point included over two dozen major candidates. While Clinton held back on an official endorsement during the primaries, she offered praise for Biden after his string of victories on Super Tuesday that kicked off virtually ascent to presumptive nominee. But Clinton's endorsement also comes after she did not say and did shay away from criticism and criticizing Sanders with whom she engaged in a bitter fight over the Democratic nomination in 2016, that same point as contributing factor in losses to Trump. And that does it for this report right here on the Riley King Network. Have a great evening. I'll see you back here tomorrow with more reports. Good night and bye.